adventure well i got some tips and tricks for you let me know what you think in the comments down below and don't forget to hit the like button my first tip would be scan as much as possible every time you visit the base some sort of campment enemies indoor areas when you put down a settlement always scan everything before you go this is important because of the crafting system in mass effect andromeda the more things you scan from certain alien races including humans the more research data you get from that and then you can spend that on finding blueprints for new weapons and gear and trust me you want that since it can really give you an early advantage the first time you will find a research center where you can buy these blueprints and also get this new gear you will not have enough research data to do anything but once you go on and venture into the world discover more things and don't forget to scan them then the next time you visit this crafting station things will open up before you get a blueprint of anything it's smart to go to development and then look at what blueprints you've already found that you don't spend your valuable research data on a type of armor or weapon that you already got a great blueprint for it's also smart to see what research data you got the most because that gives an indication of what is easy to get and what is harder to get what is more rare for example, in the beginning the Helios research data is pretty easy to get, so they can better look at spending your research data on that. It's also that the gear is pretty easy to get from Helios on the early level. Just go to development and see what you need by hitting the square button, you can see where you can also find the things that you don't really have. Here you will see that the Helios gear is not that hard to get early on. Skill points are also a nice way to upgrade your character. A basic thing you should know is that the triangle next to a skill means that it's a passive skill, so that is active at all times, and that the circle means that it's an active skill, and you can only carry three of them at the same time. Since leveling up your character in Mass Effect Andromeda can take a while, I recommend that you stick to three skills that you like, invest in them, and then unlock others. If you don't know if you will like the skill, but you think you would, you can also just spend one skill point, try it out, and then invest in it later. It's certainly smart in the beginning to only have three skills unlocked and then enhance them, because like I said, you can only carry three, so if you really dedicate all your skill points to those skills, they will really give you an early edge. Personally, I really like the energy drain skill. This skill lets you steal shields from boss enemies, and in the early game you will not really see a lot but you will encounter more and more of them and being able to steal like a half of their shield and if you enhance this skill even more can really help you in fighting those and it will also give you the shield so you can stay alive for longer i also sticked with the concussive shot it's really nice for some early damage i will go deeper into the skills in another video so be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on that Speaking of early damage, don't underestimate your melee attack. This one is really powerful versus a lot of enemies and should be used as often as possible. It can deal more than half of their health, so two hits is enough. And if you keep upgrading your melee weapon, of course new in this Mass Effect game, then you will really, really see the benefit of that and that will help you a lot. I'm talking around with this awesome early game loadout that I want to make a video on, so stay tuned for that. You can also enhance your relationships with other people. You will see a part of the beginning of the game now, I didn't want to show you anything after that because of spoilers obviously, but after every huge story mission it's smart to go back to the Tempest and then check on everyone. Do a little small talk, get to know them better, and who knows what might happen, wink wink. Okay, that's it for the general Mass Effect Andromeda tips and tricks. I will have combat tips, skill tips up, weapons.